Hi friends, this is a video I never thought I would even be interested in making, and that is about the weather. As we all have heard, especially in the United States, there is an historic storm heading towards Florida as we speak. Florida is in for a storm, the likes of which it has not seen in 110 years. I'm here today because we just got over a storm in the U.S., where several southern states were hit with Hurricane Helene and the catastrophic damage that has been left behind in her wake. In the midst of this tragedy, uh, there are a few very loud, very vocal people who have made it their mission to spread this information about the storm and the response to the storm. I am not an, a government official. I do not have a dog in this fight. But I think that it is a responsible thing to do to, as just an average citizen, to tell you to take this storm seriously. Do not allow anyone to politicize this storm. Mother Nature does not give a single fuck whether you are a Democrat, a Republican, or somewhere in between. You need to make sure that you are doing everything, and that means everything, in your power to be safe. If your leaders have said, hey, it's time to evacuate, you guys need to get the F out of Dodge, I would probably get the F out of Dodge. If there are any things that you can do to assist other people, whether they are politically affiliated with you or not, if you can assist your neighbor, be a good neighbor, because you'll never know when that will be you in need of help. Now, I'm saying all of this because as I'm talking, you're seeing either images of the hurricane or some of the distasteful things that have been said and some of the blatant and outright lies that have been um, disseminated in the wake of Hurricane Helene. We have people who need assistance who are not getting assistance because, number one, of a distrust of the government, which sometimes I can't blame you. It's very foolish to talk about armed militias against FEMA. Are you crazy? So I'm, I'm saying all of this. And I'm going to leave this as unedited as I possibly can because I really want you to understand I'm coming to you not as somebody who thinks they know it all, but as just somebody who cares about humanity. Please, please do what you have to do to keep yourself safe. Do what you must do to help others. And don't let people who are sitting in a place isolated and insulated from your worries use you and your safety as a political pawn. Don't let those people uh, think for you. Think for yourself. Survival mode. What can I do right now to make the situation better than it will be if I sit around in fear and think about all of these fear-mongering folks and all of the crazy things that they are saying when you can use your platform for something better than that? If, there, if, if there's anyone that you want to listen to today, please... I have not a dog in this fight. Please listen to me. Be safe. Be smart. And don't fall for the banana in the tailpipe. This is just something that people can use, no matter which side of the aisle that you sit on. This is a situation that people can use to sow division, if that's what they want to do. I'm saying, don't be that person. Don't sow division. Don't listen to these people on the internet. These are people who could be anywhere in the country telling you how to ride out a storm. Be smart, y'all. And I'm going to hope that everybody is safe and everybody is enduring on the other side of this. Um, and yeah, just take care of each other. All right, peace.